Nico Joachini at the top of a 4-2-3-1 alignment. Edward Leuven as a number 10 midfielders. Indiana Vasilev and Miguel Perez. Eric Miller is at left back. Dario Zuperic, Marvin Loria draw in. Kyle Hebert on a sneaky header provided the game winner in the 75th minute. St. Louis City will start with the ball and Tim Parker plays this out of the back. Return ball, Leuven has the option in Vasilev. Indiana Vasilev off the left foot, fires over the bar. You can see the referee straight away. He signals to the, to the touch line to get the physios on. You just see in a second here, just as he goes to turn there, there's nobody near him, and then he's straight away, he's in pain. St. Louis aren't to know that, they carry on. The strike eventually comes in from Vasilev, who loves to get forward as well, but it's just always rising at the moment. Chara quickly ahead. Loria going for goal. Testing an alert, Roman Berkey. David Ayala subbed out. Christian Paredes on to take his place. And with Portland's Evander over the ball in St. Louis, the second half begins now. City, he is listed as an available sub. Parker under pressure. Bully curls a shot, just missed. Sent Berkey diving to his left. Best opportunity for the Timbers on the night. Lewis initially winning back, but then Portland straight away there on top of it. Parker didn't have as much time as he thought he might have had. And then Bully gets straight on it. You see exactly what he's trying to do, trying to curl it into that far corner. Has Joe Akini making a run. Jared Stroud. Skied high by McGraw. Top of the box and a shot! Off the foot of Lillen goes wide. Getting on the front foot, they are getting out wide, they're getting balls into the box then. And you just see this from Arm, um, it's just a beautiful touch, plays inside to Leuven, he's just not able to get the strike on target. He's good pressure, Chara made sure that he was able to get to him quick. Tracked by Hebert, Moreno again, that's a terrific ball, here's Paredes, pulls it back, Paredes lays it off, Moreno, big save made by Berkey! Oh, the man who made a dozen last week answers the call. This is a brilliant save. It's great build-up from Portland. Lovely forward one from Paredes. And then, see Moreno, he just thinks he's going to put the finishing touches on it. Evander deflects for Moreno. Moreno to play this ball ahead. Bully will get on it. Frank Bully with a shot saved by Berkey. The rebound loose, cleared away by City. A penalty to plays in terms of this pass, the way that it held up. As the ball's played through now, it holds up for Bully to get onto because the wind is against Portland. And then initially, it's a great save from Berkey. I'm not convinced. I'm not convinced that it's handball. If anything, it looks like I think it's Nelson actually goes in first with his head. I'm not too sure. I'd be interested. I think the referee should go and have a look at this at VAR. We see the opportunity here for Bully. He takes it. It's a good save. Looks like he falls on it. But he's... The Brazilian, ever so deftly, goes right, and it's the Timbers who have the lead on the road. you would say is that Poland have been the better team in this second half and it's so cool from Evander you see Berkey he's waiting to the last possible second to make the decision with which he's gonna go to and you see the response as well from Savarese Loria comes out of the match as does Frank Bully who scored two goals in the U.S. Open Cup victory several days ago for St. Louis, will come into the match. Ball took a deflection. Ostrak with a slew of timbers around him. This ball to the right side. Alm, that's a good ball. Ostrak in the 18, squares that tying goal! Sergio Pompeo levels the match in the 79th minute. 
down the right hand side. It involves both substitutes. You see, Army initially gets the ball, and then it's a lovely run from Ostrak. He puts the ball in then for Pompeu, who does the rest. And it's the first time, really, that they've been able to use the width, outnumber Portland down the side, and make the best use of it. And with these conditions, you know that you can't float that ball into the box. So it's a lovely pass back from Ostrak, and then Pompeo. Pompeo, he does the rest and put the ball to the back. City was seeking an MLS franchise as far back as 2007. It became reality this year. Here's Moreno coming out of the scrum with it. Santiago Moreno cut centrally, able to lay this off, and a shot go! It is Jimmy Chana in his return to the Portland Timbers with the go-ahead goal, and the momentum swings again. As well, but it's all about Moreno. He switched over to the left-hand side since Jimmy Chara has come onto the pitch, and he plays a lovely ball, but this finish, because he takes it first time, Berkey isn't expecting it. He's probably expecting Jimmy Char in this scenario to take a touch first, but because he doesn't, Berkey is just left stood still. He doesn't move, and it's an emphatic finish. And what makes Picks up Jimmy Chara. He has a man in Mosqueda. Played centrally. This is Evander. Worked across. Paredes dancing around one defender. Works it across out of midair. The shot goes wide. That was Nias Gona. Looking to hammer away a result on the volley. Nelson heads it away. Taken here by McGraw. Play it back. One final act. Ivacic plays it ahead, and that is all.